Okay. Now, hello everyone. Okay, now let's start with a question in the online assignment, question eight. A lot of you asked me about it. And uh, guys in the line, wait a minute, please. I know you, Mr. Rayyan. I know, Mr. I mute myself. Uh, a lot of you asked me about, asked me before about question eight in the online assignments. Let's see the question together and solve it together. Okay? Done? Yeah. Time. Uh, where is it? It's in grade seven, I think. Here, then here, then here. Okay, I will choose any student randomly. Huh? Yes. What? Yeah. Question. Question eight, I think you asked me about, right? Let's do question eight together. I will share the screen, guys, for, for uh, the students there. Okay, but I want to make sure that everyone sees here. Mr. Amr, are you with me? Yes, Mr. Amr. What do you see in the board? Uh, the online assignment we solve. Good. So you see the question, right? Yeah. Good. Thank you. Now let's read the question together then. Okay. Now, a heart. Mr. Can I solve it to you? No, thank you. Just understand it, please. Because a lot of the students ask me about it. Now, a hot air balloon raises, rises, sorry, 340 feet into the air. Rises means a plus or minus plus. So the first number, and please record it, record it, record it with me, plus 340, right? Right, copy, copy, plus 340. Then it descends 130 feet. اكتب بلس 1 340 عشان ما ننسى اكتب واحد بس اكتب سليمان بلس 340 then it descends 130 feet descend means going down so plus 340 minus 130 خلاص then goes up 80 feet so plus 80 right then down another 45 feet means minus 45. Check. Fine. Until now, everything is normal. But here, the question is different. Look here. How many feet will the balloon need to return to the ground? What's the answer of these uh, numbers? Plus uh, 240 minus 130 plus 80 minus 45. It will be plus, if you calculate these numbers, it will be plus 240. 45. So as, as a first look, you will choose question one, uh, answer one. Right? Click my. Yani intel the calculations, the answer will be in your calculation numbers here. Plus 245, right? So I will choose, you will go, because you see plus 
245 here, you will be happy. You will go and quickly select the 245. But you didn't read the question. The question said, how many this, this balloon need to be in the ground? Now he is on the height, how much? 245. How much it need to go to the, the ground? He will go down. How much he will go? It will go down. How much? 245. That's why the correct answer is not one. It is what? Two. This is student here. I don't know but what's his name, by the way. Don't say. He said he, he chose one as most of you do, it's okay. But next time, please focus with the question. If the question said, huh, what if the question said, what is the height, the height of the balloon at this moment? It will be plus 245, normal. But the question said, now it is, I know, we all know that it's in plus 245. How much it needs to be in the ground? He will go down. It will go down until to get the ground. How much? Two hundred forty-five down, which is got it. Understand it. Mean I said I need attempt else in the line assignments. Else, online students, online students. Any question about the online assignment or about this question exactly? Question eight. So a lot of you send me messages that, Mister, you have mistake. Mister, you have wrong. Mister, you no, Mister, you have mistake, not me. Focus on the question. That's all. Thank you. Now, yesterday we have we had a homework, right? Let's check the homework together. But before that, let me see what you did in your home, please. Nine two. Let me see your homework. Multiplication integers. Uh, sorry, division integers. We did the multiplication, right? Mean enter. Ahmed. Ahmed is. Ahla. Ahla. Wallah. Ha. Mr. Shukri, your homework. Yeah, division of integers. Ha. What's your name? Abdullah. What? Abdullah Bahjat, hmm. Halil, you, Mr. Yazan, try to bring books. Try to bring book as soon as you can. Okay, Mohsen, Yazid, Rahman, Ahmed, Rayyan, Suleiman. Habibna, Hon, P homework. Is there a homework? This page, did you solve it? It's a homework. Page 165, see it? Good boy. Okay, let's check the answers together. Here and online, guys, please check your answers, page 165 with me before we start our new lesson. 165, right? Yeah. yeah. Let's check it, please. We are on page 165. Check your answers. If you have mistakes, fix them. But the most important, to understand why you have mistakes. If you don't understand, you can ask me before we start. So question one, the answer is negative 11. Question two, negative 10. Question three, negative 25. Check your answers with me, please. Please, guys. Question four, we have eight, positive eight. Question five, we have three. Question six, it is five, positive. Question seven, it is negative 16. Question eight, it is four. Question nine, it is negative four. Question 10, Negative three, question 11, three, question 12, negative nine, and the last two questions, 13, negative 60, 
and 14 negative 125. Now these are the key answers of your homework. Check your answers. Don't leave mistakes. I will start with the online students. Guys, in the online, if you have any questions, put your hands, please. Omar. Sir, I have a question. Uh, question six. Question six. We have negative 50 divided by negative 10. Negative 50 divided by negative 10. Similar signs or different signs, yeah, Omar? Similar. Similar. The answer is positive or negative? Positive. What's the answer of 50 divided by 10? ضحكني معك. تضحك كمان مرة بزعلك. بزعلك كثير. Good boy. Ah, Mr. Omar. Hello. Yes. What's yes. the answer? 50 divided by 10, يا ابني. How much? Five. طيب what's the problem? Positive or negative? Positive. Ah, ايش المشكلة? Is there any problem? No, I was divided. Uh, you was. Now you understand zero. it. Yeah, mystery. Now you understand it. Yes. Thank you. Else? Else, guys, any questions? We have Rayyan. Yes, mister. Hello. Uh, mister, I don't understand number 14. Read. Our read. Aaron made a three with the draws last month. What's the meaning of with the draw? Into my Ryan. Nam. What's the meaning of with the draw? Do you know? No. With the draw to take money from your account. Okay. Okay. So positive or negative? Negative. How many times? Three, not negative three. three. Not negative three. Three is the number of the times. And he went to the bank account, you know the ATM, three times yes. this week. Class, type. Let's continue. Last month, sorry. Each time he withdraw the same amount. كل مرة كان يسحب نفس الفلوس. يعني ميتريال, ميتريال, ميتريال. خلاص. طيب. A total, the total of the money, شو راح ثلاث مرات. كل مرة yes. كان يسحب نفس الفلوس. The total of the money. He withdraw with this from this bank account is 375. 375. Now I'm asking you, yeah, mister, the 375, is it positive or negative should be? Uh, positive. Yabni, you when you get money from the bank, the money will increase or decrease? لا تنقص. It's positive or negative? Negative. Negative. So the total of the money is negative 300. This is question 30, 14. Negative 300, how much? 75. Why negative? Because he took it from the bank account. Now, in how, how many times? And at the same time, they, he took the same amount of money, okay? Now, what's the question once? What integer represents the change in his account after the first withdrawal? We will divide on what? On the number of times, which is three. Assume that you took from your father three times money. Don't talk, Yabni, I'm talking. Assume that you went to your father this day at the morning three times. At the three times, you took the same amount of money. You took from him 30 real. How much each time you took? 10. كلهم مع بعض 30. ثلاث مرات كل مرة كم راح تكون 10, 10, 10. So you divide 30 on 3, right? So here the same right. idea. Negative 375 divided by 3 is make long division. Now, 
different signs, negative 125. Got it? Got it. Here, yeah, mister, you need to understand the question context. You need to understand the question, the words. If you have a word that you didn't understand, open your translator. Yeah. Because the meaning of the word tells you if it's positive or negative. Don't forget negative. that. Thank you. Mr. I sent for you the homework. Mr. I see every homework you send. Don't worry. Okay. But let's go to our things now. Uh, we are done with the homework, class. But here, before we start the lesson, I want to make for you an important summary for the whole formulas. We talk on the four operations, which are addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division. So prepare your copy box because you will copy the table in your copy box and I want you to memorize it as you memorize your name. تحفظ زي اسمك. Got it? ولد وراه. لا تحكي مع اللي جنبه. ما لا حكيت. ما هي حكيت ولا ما حكيت؟ يعني إذا سألت بتكون ما حكيت مثلا. اسألنا أنا. Ask me. That's why they pay me money. عشان هيك بيعطوني فلوس عشان أجي أنا أجاوبك. صح؟ طيب let's take this table. This table but you start, يعني pay attention to the board guys so you understand the table. How you use the table. Okay? Now I'll start with a line like this. A line like this. And like this. And like this. Make it bigger. Big. On your copy box so it fits everything. Now understand the the Understand it first, guys, before you copy. Look at the board, look at the board, look at the board. Now, we have four operations, addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division, right? Here, our right, addition, and what? Subtraction together, right? Don't try it, wait. And here, our right, multiplication, and division together, okay? Now, at each operation, we said we have two cases. Either we have similar signs or, and on each one, we did something different, right? On addition and subtraction, we did something, and on division and multiplication, we did another thing, right? Type here. If we have same signs, I will go here in addition and subtraction. What we did if we have same signs? We add with the same sign, copy it. Add and put the same sign. Type. If we have different signs in addition and subtraction, what we do here? Subtract with the bigger sign by the way the bigger sign is always positive the positive is bigger than negative but here we talk virtually we imagine the bigger with the bigger number that's all just to get the answer different signs which is subtract and put the bigger sign okay guys we are done with mean. Type. Look at the board. Allah. Same signs where in multiplication and division. What we do if we have same signs in multiplication and division? Always the answer is write it. The answer. Yani you multiply or divide and you put what? Positive. The answer is. Positive. عشان ما تفهمها plus. هذه مش plus. هي positive. Positive. اسمها positive. Is positive. طيب. The last part. If we have different signs in multiplication and division, 
The answer is negative. The answer is what? Negative. And don't forget our small box, remember? Remember the box, guys? If we have two signs, we replace them with one sign always. Don't forget that because it's useful. So at this board now here, you have everything we took until now. Everything in one page. Everything. For example, if you want to remember what we do in multiplication and division if we have different signs, you will go to the different signs here and pass until you get that multiplication and division here. The answer is negative. Get it? Him the table. Guys in the online students, try to copy the table quickly, please. Quickly. Quickly. When I'm going to put the book. Yeah. From the table, yeah, Mohsen. Akid. Now, when you want to revise the four lessons, the four lessons. If you want to revise the formulas for the four lessons, it is everything in front of you in one page. No need to keep searching. Where is the formula? Copy it in your copy book. Now I will go to. Our lesson, okay, which is apply integer operation. Yeah. Done here. Done. Yeah, with this one. Yeah, keep it beside so you don't forget it also. Quickly, guys, done. Now, if you miss writing it, this video will be downloaded after a while into the cluster. You can open it and copy it again. Okay. So I will go directly to it's important, guys. Huh? I will go to my lesson, which is Apply Integer Operations, page 167. Go there. No need. Now in your book. Yeah. Lesson five. Apply. Integer operations. What are the operations? We have four operations plus, minus, add, add subtract, multiply, divide, right? Now, in the previous lessons, in addition, we took add only. In subtraction, we took subtract only. In multiplication, multiply only, right? In division also, divide only. But in this lesson, we will take more than one operation at the same question. Got it? We will take multiply and divide, then add in the same question. Now, to manage this lesson very well, we need to follow something very important which is order steps, order of akhadna, so let's remember the order of operations which we need to follow at each question at this lesson, okay? Yeah. Always, huh? always, always follow mean order of operations. Okay, always. What are the order of operations? We have four steps, right? The first one is the parentheses. Exponents. Awal wahad mean parentheses. But the word al parentheses, huh? Shit. Yeah. Our brackets in the now. Mazbot. Lomo adol. 
Second is exponent. Exponents, all the powers. You can say exponents, you can say powers. It's okay. Third, from left to right. Question, uh, step three, multiply or multiply and, not or. I know, but in grade six, we took it with positives only. So, in grade six, we took order of operations if we have positive numbers only. But at this level, you will have mixed positive and negative because now you know how to deal with. So multiplication and, and division from left to right. Type. Last thing, always you do what? Addition and good. Okay, done. Ha. La, اللي بتلاقيه أول. In three and four guys here, multiply. That's why they said and divide from left to right. يعني أنت after you finish with the first two steps, you will go from left to right. If you find multiply, you do multiply. If you find divide. You divide, you do divide. What comes first? You do it first. يعني مش ال multiply بالأول بعدين ال divide لا. They are at the same step. ال بيجي بالأول بتعمل. Got it? Time. This is the order of operations which we need to follow always in this lesson. Apply integer operations. I will give you example before we start with the book. Okay? For example. Minus a three multiply two plus bracket six minus seven not minus seven sorry three divided by negative two plus Nine to the power two. We have everything here. We have addition, we have subtraction, we have multiply, we have divide, we have exponent, we have parentheses, right? We have everything. Now, how I will deal with this question, guys? First step, I will back to the my order of what this? Sorry, to my order of yes, sir, operation. Okay, which is here. First step, I will search about. Let's go to the question. I will step in parentheses. And always, if you remember, I said to you, always do one step only. And the others, what? Comes down, right? Let me merge up from the step at the same time. Step by step. So I will see. Equal. Everything else will stay the same. Huh? Negative three times two plus parenthesis six minus a three done the parenthesis divided by negative two. Malish, but I don't want the fraction here. I want to just change this to be two. No, I'm sorry. Okay. So here it will be what? It will be four, right? Because I want to just avoid to be fractions. So here four divided by negative two plus nine to the power of two, right? What I did in this step only, only. Now the second step is to get rid of the powers. We have power nine power two. Nine power two, it's not 18. It is nine by nine, which is. So I will write everything, but in the place of this, I will copy. The 81, got it? So this is equal negative three times two plus four divided by negative two plus. I'm done with the parentheses. I'm done with the exponents. Now, number three, and the question which uh, Mohsen asked me, which we will do first, right? 
Here, I will go from left to right. From left to right, I have multiply, then I have divide. I will do the first one, then the second one. Got it? What comes first? Okay, so this is equal. Uh, negative three times two. Now we will go to our formulas. Different signs in multiplication. The answer is always negative. So it is negative what? Plus four divided by negative two plus 81. I did only one step, the multiplication. Now I will do what? The division. Still the division. Negative six plus four divided by negative two. Different signs. The answer is negative two. A plus. Start. Now what we have plus and minus. Add and subtract. What comes first? The addition. This addition. Remember our box? If we have plus with minus, we replace it with, remember? Yeah, let's apply here. So here, this plus and minus, I will replace it with minus. I have negative six, negative two. If we have same signs in subtraction and addition, we add, it will be negative six and two plus, so the last step we will add different signs, subtract. So, so this is equal, the bigger sign is positive. 81 minus 8, it is 70. Four. 70 what? Three. Done. 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 Now, directly, I will go to example one in the book. Example one in the book. Example one, even the lesson guys has no introduction. See, take a look to your lesson. The, the title and directly what? Because you took all of the operations before. So it, it, the book is started with the examples directly without introduction. So we will do the same. Example one. We are on page 167, don't forget that. Find, find negative four, bracket three, plus bracket negative seven. Look here. Look at the board. What we have here, we have multiply here, right? Then here add. What we do first, the multiply or the, by the way, do we have parentheses? Yes, we have, but what's inside these parentheses? Only one number. So it's not the first step there. Got it? So here we have multiply, then what? Add. What we do first? Multiply, then we will add. But let's multiply these two numbers. Negative four times a three, our formula. Different signs, the answer is yeah. So this is equal, negative 12, and the other number stays the same. So, five. Here we have add. We have two signs followed by each other. Plus with minus in the box. Replace it with. So these two signs, I will replace them with negative. Now we have negative 12, negative 7. We add and put the same. Plus. But directly, we have check after this example. Let's do it together. We have check after this example. Let's do it together. So I will go to the online students, guys. I'm sorry. Sorry. Mr. Hisham. Yes, Mr. Do you understand, yeah, Hisham? Yes. Yeah, read the, the, the check with me, please. Fine, negative five. Negative five. Parenthesis, negative 12. Multiply negative 12. Plus negative 15. Plus negative 15. Right? Yes. Right. Now, I will write, wait, Hisham, a minute. Don't conf be confused. What? No. Don't be confused with these brackets, okay? Ma ma okay. Yani. Brackets, just to for the number. 
But yes. if we have operations inside the bracket, it will be the first step, right? Yalla ya Hisham. What we'll do, what we have here, we have multiply, and then yes. we have what? And then we but have what? Mash, we have multiply uh, here, and then we have what? Uh, Addition. We have we'll uh, do what first? Multiplication. Yalla, let's do multiplication. We have negative five, multiply negative 12. What's the answer? Uh, positive 60. Positive. Why positive? Because they have the same sign. The answer is always positive. Now the others will come. No, plus no. minus 15. Okay. Don't do it mentally. Let it first step into a mental instead of a level. Step by step, I'm going to make answer. So, now what we have, we have addition. We have, we have addition. signs here. What we will do with them? We will subtract and uh, take the bigger numbers. Yes, there are two signs. We have two signs followed by each other. So I'm going to do it plus minus. We will put them in the same circle. And we replace we will them go by from the negative. box, right? So I will replace these two signs with negative. Now we have plus 60, negative 15, right? Ah, yes. Hisham, let me hear your friend, please. What we will do? We will subtract and take the bigger number. Bigger so. sign, not bigger number. So here equal, subtract 16 with 15, it's 40. 45. Five, the bigger. Negative 40. Plus, plus, yabni. Positive is bigger here. Get it? Yes. Any problems? No. This is the check. Thank you, Hisham. I will go directly to example what? Two. Don't talk, Yabni. Don't talk. Sam Akhtara. Negative point. Negative four. Multiply negative five. Multiply negative two. Minus, minus eight. Pay attention, please. Pay attention. Here, look at the board, please. Here I have here multiply, and also here multiply. So I Abdullah. And then here we have what? Subtract. So, so I'll do the first multiply, then the second multiply, then I will subtract. Check. So let's do the first multiply, the first two numbers here only. And the others will come down the same. Negative four multiply negative five is positive 20. So here it will be equal plus 20. And the others comes the same. The others comes the same. Okay, five. Here I have another multiply now. Positive, multiply negative. What's the answer should be? This is equal negative. 20 times two. Come 20 times two, 40. 40, Adola 40. Minus, minus it, right? Minus, minus, we replace it with? from the box. So these two negatives, I'll replace them with plus. This is equal minus 40 plus eight. Different signs, subtract with the bigger sign to be negative. We will stop here at this example. You don't have homework today. We didn't finish the lesson. Tomorrow we'll continue with this lesson, starting from the check of example two. Remind me with that, please. Don't do the homework. We didn't finish, okay? This lesson takes two periods, okay? That's all for today. For the online students, if you have any questions, you can ask me tomorrow. Thank you so much.